Back with more do ring. We still are naked. We may be naked, but at least we're handsome and naked. Imagine being ugly and naked. The first time I played through this game, these birds gave me so much trouble. Jesus. And they still do give me a little bit of trouble. Hey, what's up, Andrew? How are you doing? I was tempted to do a magic build, but my brain likes swords and just beating the shit out of people. I say swords, but I only have a club right now. Isn't there a boss on these rooftops, if I remember correctly? Let me get the mallet. Link fans here. Hey, everybody. Calm down. Celebrity in the chat. How's the Elden Ring going? I think it's going pretty good. First few hours, we already beat one major boss. The first time I played this game, it took me seven hours to beat the boss. And, like, get to the boss and then beat it. This time I'm playing, I am... Two hours and 53 minutes in, and we have already got past the boss that we were that we're referencing. So we're doing pretty good. Who are you fighting? Does this count as a church? Permadeath run one. Hell no. Ah, nice to meet you. The pleasure's mine. Roger is the name. A sorcerer, as uh, you might have guessed. I'm looking for a little something. Up here comes Stormy. When I'm not hot footing it from the troops, that is. But enough about me. What are you doing here in Stormvale Castle? This place is bristling with tarnished hunters, you know. They sacrifice our kind. For grafting. Not exactly a place I'd stroll into without a purpose in mind. Stormy! I see. Here to challenge Godric and lay your hands upon a great rune, are you? You can see it then, I take it. The guidance of grace. Well, Stormy. enjoy it while you can. I'm tarnished, like you. But unlike you, I've seen neither hide nor hair of this guidance for the longest time. Still... I won't forget how it felt when I first came here, to the lands between. I'm privy to a few magical battle arts. Would you care to learn one? As a fellow tarnished, once guided by grace, I'd love to help you out, if it please. <clears throat> Stormy's just being a cat. Ash of War spinning weapon, usable on a small and medium swords, axes and hammers, as well as pole arms and staves. Great Spears accepted. Eh. We don't really need anything. Don't really need anything from him. Yeah, sure, you guys are just standing here, minding your own business. But what if somebody came up and killed you? I.e. me. Oh. Oh, I remember you. I struggled against you for a good handful of tries. 
good handful. I struggled with him because there was the guy behind him. Did I try to bait him out into, into here, maybe? I'm not sure. Maybe I should kill his little bodyguard first. Come on, big boy. Stormy, what are you doing? Uh, I have one health. can't take him. I didn't beat that knight in that castle. I grabbed his key and then I kind of left. 18 deaths, 18 deaths. Oh, I gotta fight these fucking birds again then. Eh, maybe I can run by them. Didn't really like fighting the birds. Oh boy. Well, it looks like I can't run by the birds. Nineteen. Nineteen deaths. Killed a couple of them. Ah, uh, yeah, they have swords for feet. And they... I was being chased by one. 20 deaths. 20. Sorry. Okay, you're just sitting there wagging your tail, as always. Don't think your tail has never not been wagging. Even when she sleeps, her tail is wagging. Twenty-one. I go through the first time, kill all the birds, easy. Twenty-one. The good news is, good news, good news. I was up to like a hundred deaths the first time I played this game when I got to here. Be weary of be weary of the left. That's where Beyonce put all of her bags. Fucking Christ. Twenty two. Nice drip. Thanks, game nerd. As always, I don't have any clothes in this game. The birthday drip. What up, Chaotic? Yeah, I was... I was gonna take some time away from the souls, but I've been watching a lot of Elden Ring, and it made me want to play Elden Ring. And there's no better time than now to play Elden Ring. Plus, there's a lot of indie games coming out in July that I want to play. So... I it's a good time to get an Elden Ring run going. It's a good time.
My goal is to get quite far before I travel for a week, because I'm going to visit my family at the end of the month, and I'll be gone for a week. My goal is to make it quite far. Prob in a perfect world, I would beat the game, but I don't think I could beat the game in a week. But you never know, I have beat this game once already. Do you not like my hat? It's I know it's a very beautiful hat. Maybe DLC, maybe DLC. Hope you're doing good though. Which I'm trying to play it like for four hours a day. I want to beat most of the base before getting to DLC. Maybe not the Elden Lord, but stuff like Melenia and whatnot. Gotta pump them up to eight. Don't think I can dedicate eight hours a day to Elden Ring when I have a YouTube channel to get content for out. <laughs> Even though Elden Ring can definitely bring numbers in. Keyword can, not guaranteed. Daniel Fetter, Mr. Elder Wilds Gamer, with the raid. What up, Peppermint? What up, Sana? What up, Tana? What up, Lil Lotus Dragon? What up, Rob? Hey, Fenner, did you finish uh, the uh, Outer Wilds game? We are naked right now in this run. Welcome in. We have 23 deaths and counting, but we have defeated one major boss already. So we have that going for us. I was going to wait to play Elden Ring, but everyone else has been playing Elden Ring, and it made me want to play Elden Ring. So here we are. What up, Huckleberry? How are you doing? Chad, if you're not following Papa Fen, you are openly admitting to crime on stream. You are openly committing to crime. Hey, Dreza, how are you doing? Hope uh, Elder Wilds is good, though. I was watching a little bit this morning, and I still don't know what the fuck is happening in that game. I saw you just go straight into the sun, though, at one point, and that was kind of funny. Do the hokey pokey, and then you turn yourself around. Love to destroy furniture? Yeah, fuck them. If I can't have it, nobody can. Furniture is so damn expensive. I spent $1,000 on a couch this year. It's a very comfortable couch, though. We just watched an explanation, and you're still confused. Well, at least I'm not the only one who gets confused by that game. The giant anglerfish exist. And yet, people still love the game. Oh, boy. This is getting a little... Well, it's getting a little hairy and a little bloody. <laughs> but yeah, we're playing Elden Ring today. Then we're playing another game uh, later. I'm blanking on the name of it for like the eighth time. God damn it. And it scares them. I can't tell if you're like being an Outer Wilds fanatic now. I hate these fucking birds.
Listen, if we're talking about fears, we don't need to, uh... We don't need to talk about my fears in the world. Oh my god. 24, 24, 25 deaths, 25 deaths. Twenty-five deaths. Your fear is the deep ocean. I get that. I respect that. I live with that as well. Understanding why people love it. Hey, man. Some people love Twinkies. Are you one of those people that loves Twinkies? My fear is Burr playing Elden Ring with clothes. God damn. Deep Divers on Netflix. I have a small fear. It was larger. I've gotten it smaller of the deep ocean as well and being like trapped in the ocean. On a boat. I have that fear because of all the monsters that live in the water. And it's like, it's the fish's land. Why the hell should I go in there? But I'm getting better with it. Zebra cakes are better than Twinkies. What's that one treat that they had in uh, Zombie Land? When, uh, what, Woody Harlison's, Woody Harlison's character is looking for Twinkies? And they find a truck of hostess treats, and it's not Twinkies. He wants Twinkies, but they find a truck, and it's not Twinkies. What is it? It's those little pink coconut things? Those little, like, it, they're like little pink coconut round things? Snowballs. They're fucking snowballs! Not fucking Twinkies! It's like, bro... I've never had snowballs, so I can't relate to his character, but. They're definitely snowballs. I was a big fan of Hostess Cupcakes growing up. Also, hey, Reeb. I was a big Hostess Cupcakes fan. I hate this guy. I think I can run by him. I already killed him once. I don't want to kill him every time. It takes time, man. I guess I can run by him. He ain't doing nothing. But, Cat, I like chocolate ones that have vanilla in the middle. Not, you can't, I, double vanilla is too much vanilla, you know? What is this, sex? Come on. Double chocolate's too much chocolate. I never said anything about double chocolate being the premium choice. I agree. Double chocolate's too much chocolate. Chocolate around and then the vanilla in the middle. I also don't eat hostess treats a lot because they are incredibly unhealthy. Incredibly sugary. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm that guy. I'm that guy you hate. Twenty-four. I think that's twenty-six. Stormy, why are you looking at Nami? She's just cleaning herself on top of a tree. You go up there sometimes, what are you jealous cause she took it? You were sitting on my PC. Look at the time. Oh god, it's Wednesday. I thought it was Thursday. Well, that gives me an extra day. Since I'm gonna be gone next week. 
Well, not next week. I'm going to be gone in two weeks. I leave on a Sunday. You guys, I'm not going to be streaming for a week. June 30th to July 6th. I'm going to see my immediate family. For the first time in four years. I absolutely hate traveling outside of Canada because I'm afraid I'm never going to get back in, but... Once again, I am traveling outside of Canada to the United States of America. God have mercy. My mom will definitely be happy to see me. I'll be happy to see my family, but... DM'd you the info? Thank you. Now you're coming back. I have to come back. I'm visiting my family for the first time in four years. What's the, the stressful thing is both flights there are layovers because we live in a place that's not really a destination you travel to a lot, even though we are a major city in Canada. My layover on the flight back is like an hour and 10 minutes. But the layover is from Seattle to where I live. So I have to go through customs and all of that shit because it's an international flight and I have an hour and 15 minutes from where our plane lands. And then of course, you know, when a plane lands, you have all these impatient imbeciles getting up from aisle 27D coming to the front of the plane because they put their fucking backpack up here. They're like, oh, I gotta get my luggage. I gotta, I gotta get my luggage. It's like, dude, nobody's gonna take your goddamn luggage. Nobody wants your underwear. And then there's all these clowns trying to get ahead of you when it should just be a single file line. Aisle one goes first, aisle two goes second, aisle three, and so on and so forth. So I'm probably going to miss my layover flight. Which snack are you going to have the U.S. that you can't get in Canada? Uh, they have these really good animal crackers in the United States that I can't get in Canada. And they have Chex Mix. You know the animal crackers that come in that little red box? The little red cardboard box animal crackers? They live in the middle of the country. I don't know what kind of establishments are even in the middle of the country. They don't have those in Canada? No. Tell us how you really feel about flying. I don't mind flying. Flying isn't that bad. It's just all the people that you, when you travel, you have all these motherfuckers who seem like they've never been outside of their house ever. They have like main character syndrome where they think everything should just go their way. And if something, if they, everything just has to happen to them first, they need to get service first. They need to get off the plane first. For some reason, they want to get on the plane first. Who the hell wants to get on the plane first? Getting on the plane first is awful. The only benefit is you maybe get an overhead bin. I can get that, but like, who the fuck's travel? Bro, just check your bag. They check the bags for free. If you wait long enough. Girl Scout cookies were an actual thing until you went to the US. You didn't get any though. You didn't get any Thin Mints. Bro, are you okay? My man said fuck Thin Mints. I'm also a little stressed about traveling because... As a Twitch streamer, if I travel away, my main source of income is gone for a week. I don't get paid vacation. So I'm trying to get a couple YouTube videos out before then, and I don't know if I'll be able to because I literally leave next Sunday. And I have nothing for a YouTube video right now because YouTube can actually be a passive income, unlike Twitch. Like, nobody's going in on Twitch and, like, fucking giving 10,000 bits while streamers offline. Hey, 
Hey, Metal Fuse, how are you doing? There's a dumb TikTok trend going around of people successfully sneaking in a pillowcase full of clothes trying to make it seem like a regular pillow. The point is to not pay extra for a carry-on. That doesn't seem that dumb. <laughs> that actually seems pretty smart. That seems pretty smart. Oh, hey, Juan, I need to... I don't... I, I need to beat a game. They're the next game we're playing, I have an idea for a video on the next game, but I need footage of, like, a couple other games as well with it. So, ah. Uh, we'll see. I remember this fucking guy. This guy was annoying. I got rid of one of your favorite emotes. Which one? Do I need Risk of Rain 2 footage? I do not need Risk of Rain 2 footage. But thank you. Do you need footage of me? No. The bear in the night armor and the sword. Ah, oh, sleepy night. It, it didn't get used a lot. At 6,200 sub points, we can add it back because that's when I get a new emote slot. 6,200 sub points. Do you need footage of feet? No, I'm not doing an OnlyFans. Where is a shortcut? There's probably a lot of emotes that don't get used a lot, though. Turn right. Oh my god, I didn't even take any damage. Oh, this is definitely so intentional because they have this pillar set up right here. I'm at 28 deaths also. 29 deaths. I hate these fucking birds. I know I didn't have to fight the bird, but I saw an item! How do you say no to an item? Whoa! 30 deaths. <laughs> Bro, my fucking toes did my toes made it, but the, my heels didn't. I guess that was my Achilles heel. Thirty-one. Two things in the world that let me down. Gravity and the Beatles, which is ironic because the Beatles have a song called Don't Let Me Down.
Prod, my jokes are top tier. YouTube Let's Play viewers, I'm sorry you had to hear that. Speaking of the YouTube Let's Play channel, good, good, good plug, Momo. Oh, don't bring me down as Elo. Fuck. You're right. Um, the YouTube Let's Play channel is 108 subscribers away from getting ad revenue. At 1,000 subscribers, you get ad revenue on YouTube. If you have 4,000 watch hours plus 1,000 subs. My Let's Play channel has 13,000 watch hours, but only 893 subs. If any of you subscribe, that's cool. The Let's Play channel is mostly just Twitch VODs, but, you know, sometimes there's some exclusive stuff on there. So, yeah, good plug by Momo. Good plug by Momo. Don't bring me down. Damn. Bruce? I could get the fuck out of here if I wanted to. Oh, hello. You never know, Rob. You've got the right seasonings on it. It could be delicious. It's all about the seasonings. A yuck plug. My favorite butt plug. A yuck plug. You stone sword key. I mean, I got two of them, I think, so I'll use one here. <sighs> I lost it. Is that a new weapon I could use? Iron wet blade. A shield. Ah, uh, it's just a dagger. I can't even use this. I think my dexterity's not high enough. Oh, dude, that was not worth my fucking key. That was not worth my key at all. I guess the, the upgrades are nice, but damn. For now, my stone sword key just got wasted. Fuck. That might have been my only one, too. Johnny's so curious watching Twitch. Oh, he's watching one of the best games out there. With the ring. Ow. Oh, an axe. Yeah, I hate this guy. I'm 
I'm trying to fucking two-hand it. Okay, let's see how this axe does. Oh, boy. All right. Orderly fashion line for death, please. Orderly fashion. Oh, my goodness. This is not an orderly fashion line for death. Smith and Stone, good for upgrades. Is anybody else coming over here? Sorry to surprise you, fellas. Now I'm not as sorry. This guy almost killed me. Fire arrow. Maybe it'd be good to use a bow and arrow every once in a while. It's not a staircase I can go up. Doesn't open from this side, bruh. Okay, my game lagged right when that happened. I got the lever, but I don't know if that does anything for me. Whoa, I just touched the grace and it saves me. Oh, that's nice. Just touching the grace saved me there. Let's get some level ups. Uh... I'll get strength again. Okay, well, we have this now. Let's see where this leads us. I'm not going to lie to you, I kind of miss my club. All feels natural again. All feels natural again. In the club by 50 cent. 
Go, 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 shawty. It's, it's your birthday. We gonna party like it's your birthday. We gonna sip a cardi like it's your birthday. And we got another boss fight. Are you ready? Mighty dragon. Thou art a true born heir. Lend me thy strength. Oh, We're at 30 deaths. Hey, Brandon. Deliver me on 30 deaths? 26, I wish. Well. How early did I fight this guy last time I was here? Because I don't remember fighting this guy this early. Okay. Okay, 31. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Hey, Godric. Gotta learn his attacks. Oh, I was trying to roll. 30, 30, 32, 32. Okay. Classic me. I don't know how I even got here, to be honest, but we're here.
I'm still naked. I am still naked. I have, like, no health whatsoever. His move, I'm slowly remembering his move set. Because I'm obviously fucking seeing it. His doesn't seem as bad as Marge Simpson. Was this one, two, three, four? Dodge. Too scared to play stuff like this? Nah, these games are great. than you? No! I just have more experience. Doesn't mean I'm better. You could be a god at these games for all we know. Oh, that's a tough one. where I was rolling, man. That's the move that gets me. Capybara? Thirty-four deaths. 
All right. Oh, it sounds like with the sun. Capybara! Capybara! Dude, you haven't done that move in so long, I forgot how to dodge it. Oh, this isn't going good. I have a jellyfish ash. With the status menu, you can check your level attributes, base stats, and more. Yeah. One of your flasks to health instead. One of my flasks? I only have one. But I guess an extra flask would be good. I know how this works. Does this game only start you off with three flasks? I did choose the golden seed this time, so that's how I have five flask already, but... I got six. Well, I would have five if I didn't allocate one. Is what I'm saying.
Nice and easy. Oh, I haven't seen that move in a while. I hated that Moog fight that required boss. Is that in Moog, M-O-D-H-G? I remember fighting him on my first playthrough. Bleed Boy is what I called him. Horrible boss. Absolutely hated him. There's a tear for your for your physical for your stick that negates his bleed damage when he goes into phase two. I think so. I don't think I had it though. It's gonna be tough with that damage output. We're gonna see what the axe does, because we do have an axe. So we'll see what this can do. I should have checked if this axe can cause bleed, because bleed is so fucking strong. Oh, we're doing like double damage with this thing and still getting two hits off. Come on, give me the roll. Give me the roll and the jump. You're coward! I deserve that. Well, this motherfucker brought two giant hammers with him. Give me a move I can work with, dude. Roll and jump. I did it way too early. Man, you gave me a jumping attack then. Oh, oh boy. Oh, 
Was that 36 now? 36 maybe? Still in the single digits on uh, Godric, but I have an idea. I don't know if this thing will work, but Maybe it will. It does. I've got two of them. We'll see how much it does. That fire didn't really do much. <laughs> Drop some animals and outside. Let me kick this guy's ass and then my reward is a good photo. Ah. Come on, give me the roll. When I say give me the roll, I mean do a little jump after that. Like, oh, come on. Okay. That one I just fucked up. But we're gonna need a miracle fight if we wanna win this one. Dangle with the huge raid. Yo, what up, the Donnie? What up, Lodette? What up, Schlupperman? What up, Bunny? What up, Bacteria? What up, Gibsy? What up, Tyranitar? Hey, Mac Attack. Hey, welcome in, everyone. Hey, Dangle. Hey, Scrap Arts. Hey, Kratos Maker. Hey, Ninja Chinchilla. Welcome in. Hey, Gibsy. Welcome in, gamers. We're doing an Elden Ring playthrough to get ready for you know what. Chat, if you're not following Dangle, they are a fantastic streamer. What up, Baron Tossi? Good to see you. Welcome in. We're trying to beat up Godric right now. Hope all is well. I'm doing pretty good. Hope all is well with you. Welcome in, Raiders. Welcome in. If you don't know me, my name is Burr. I'm a big variety streamer. And I just finished Dark Souls 1 for the first time yesterday. And now we're going for Elden Ring. I have beat Elden Ring a couple years ago, but I was craving more Souls-like games, so here we are. Dangle, I hope the stream was very, very good. Thanks for trusting me with the gamers. Incoming ad break. Cat, you want to snooze that ad break? Snooze that shit. We're not giving Raiders ads. Are you kidding me? How am I? I am doing good. I feel like I am much weaker on this playthrough so far compared to my previous one, but I think it took me about 12 hours to get to this point in my previous playthrough compared to four here. So uh, we're definitely better than we were before. Good luck with the fun run. Thank you. 
Thanks again for trusting me with these lovely gamers. You guys are just in time for the win and run. Am I trying a new build? No. I'm always a coward. I, I just love hitting stuff with swords and axes. I'm a basic strength guy. Nice hat. Thank you. I assume you mean in-game and not my Metroid hat, but... Fucking hate that dude. I just love a fun melee build. That's what I did in Dark Souls. I did a goddamn, I did a goddamn lightning spear for 80% of it. And then I started using a dragon sword. The good thing about the Dark Souls playthrough we just did, we actually beat every single boss that we could. Which I was very proud of, considering it was my first Dark Souls experience. Beat all the bosses. And the DLC, so... We were, uh... Gaming. A bald sage. Good old sleepy Kevin. My man doing that move. Thank you for that. Well, thanks for lurking to it. I'm glad you enjoyed it. I told myself to wait a few weeks before doing any more Souls likes, but I've been watching a lot of Elden Ring lately, and it's just... Seeing it, it's just like, man, I want to fucking play Elden Ring. So then I was like, oh, screw it. I'm just going to play Elden Ring. Who cares? It's too good of a game. It's too good. I do not want to be that far back. A viewer's run of Dark Souls run? Dark Souls? What's a viewer's run of Dark Souls 1? Elden Ring's gonna be the king. Yo, Bodsville going with the middle and Kaizo Ironmon. I respect it. I'm idiot. Make a new character, run from boss to boss, and summon viewers for fights. We gamba and watch, and they fight. That sounds awesome. <laughs> that sounds awesome. So every time I play Elden Ring, I somehow end up fucking naked. I end up naked for like 90% of the game, and I don't know how. Okay, we got the phase two. Incoming ad break. Yo, snooze those ads two more times. Fuck those ads. We're not having we're not having new viewers watch ads because they would have to watch three minutes of ads. That's awful. Now I know I can just keep punching him when he's screaming. I'll be honest, I don't remember his face too from two years ago. So this first time might be a little rough. 
but I do not have Elden Ring on my VOD channel. The VOD channel became a thing in November of 2021. Elden Ring was April and... April and May of 2021. But this one will be on the VOD channel. I think Elden Ring is the most requested game on that VOD channel. Or the game that the most people were like, Hey, is your Elden Ring playthrough on there? And it's like, no, I'm sorry. It didn't exist. And it's very disappointing because I think it was a very good fucking run. 100 hours of Elden Ring. About hundreds and hundreds of attempts to kill Melenia. Bro, oh my god, I get it. You like fire. Yeah, the only thing we have saved is my win and run against Melenia. That's the only thing we have saved. I guess that's the only thing that matters. There's some clips here and there, but... I don't even bother trying to attack him on that phase. Come on, man. Not even gonna bother, not even gonna bother. Okay. Okay, bub. Oh yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't touch him on that attack. Got an email from Epic Games. Probably some bullshit that they're trying to sell me. Update to the player agreements, bro. I don't care. Also, thanks for everyone that followed. It means a lot. We stream Monday through Friday. I, my start time is a little messy right now because I try to make a bunch of YouTube videos behind the scenes, but I try to start before 2 p.m. Eastern time, and it's 4.17 p.m. Eastern time right now, so sometimes earlier, sometimes not later than 2, though, but sometimes earlier, but if I start earlier, I'll usually go a little bit longer. I got two flasks still. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, ay, ay. I said I didn't remember his phase two. I now remember that I don't really attack him much in it. Oh. Oh boy. That's such an easy move to hit him with. But I felt like I was on the staircase. It felt off. It felt off. Uh, come on. Ad break starts in five minutes. We can snooze those ads one more time. So I think I will. Oh, cat's running over to snooze them now. She went running over. Oh my God, man. I've snoozed the ads for as long as I could. It might be time to start begging for gifted subs.
dude, this guy's got to do an attack I can hit, man. I'm freaking... I keep backing up to the staircases. Come on, man. Give me something I can work with. Oh, boy. That was close. Moneyless word, thanks for the prime for six months total. Enjoy the emotes as always. Thank you, thank you. Come on, dude, give me some. Oh shit, I tripped. No flask left. Who needs flask? Give me something I can hit you with, man. About damn time. About damn time. that one up. Oh, God. And maybe I gotta roll through that flamethrower attack. Not this one. Ah, shit. The one where he's Shh. that one I'm an idiot. is probably a good one to get some attacks off. 38 deaths. 38 deaths ain't too bad considering I had 130 by the time I probably 200 by the time I finished this boss fight in the first run. Roll into me, baby. Roll into me. He didn't roll into me. He's a coward. I don't really like trying to attack on that one. I usually like attacking on that one, but I usually don't get hit. Redemption for curse this run. Momo lives for the chaos. My man. Ah, it's four or five deaths. Not a crazy amount. Okay, this is a four hitter. One, two, three, four, thumb war. The further I the further I am away when he does that move, the more likely it is to hit me. Oh, I missed. Oh, we don't see you do that move very often, Sir Godric. Hey, Sib. Welcome in, welcome in, welcome in from the Dangle Raid. It's good to have you. Uh, by the way, if you're not subscribed to the channel, you're going to get ads in about five minutes or so. We play three minutes of ads every hour to get rid of pre-rolls because pre-rolls are awful. If you're sub to Twitch Turbo or the channel, you will not get any ads. 
If you do not have a sub, you can beg for a gifted sub with 300 channel points, and maybe someone will give you one. Grab a bio break after this fight. I mean, this is the win and run, so could be a good time. Thumb War. You don't like that? I don't like that Turbo doesn't give money to the streamer. Turbo does give money to the streamer. Uh, Turbo does give the streamer ad revenue. If you have Turbo and there's ads playing, if you're not subbed. It's not a lot, but it's something. A road. But don't worry. No, never feel bad if you're not sub to a streamer. I guarantee you. If you're watching Dangle, you're watching good streamers. And I can guarantee you, good streamers do not care if you're subscribed or not. They just appreciate you being there. I'm like, what do you say fuck me for? What's Paul playing today gifted a tier 1 sub to NS Tedersib84. They have given 141 gift subs in the channel. Paul, thanks for gifting one. I fucked that up. I see how to dodge that, though. You gotta get up close in his face, though. I guess I don't see how to dodge it. Okay, we got no flask left, but we have a dream, and we have each other, and isn't that all we need? The ad break is gonna start right when we win this, right when this fight's in the climax. I might be dead. To a crisp. Well, shoot. Thirty-nine. Well, the good news is, when the ads do start, you're only gonna miss part of the fight and not the end of the fight. So you have to look on the bright side when they start in forty seconds. Can't take a bio break in the middle of a Let's Play channel. And yeah, beg for that gifted sub. Beg for those gifted subs. Here, I'll even throw a little bit to make it look like it's not going to be interesting. Ow. Ah, just kill me. All right, enjoy the ads. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, non-subs. I'll see you in three minutes. The bald sage. Here, I'll do this for the bald sage, even though he can't hear anything. He can know I, I understand his struggles.
don't do that move very often, my friend. You don't do that one either, so I'm a little I was a little unsure about what to do there. My man got stuck. My man got stuck on the graves, foreshadowing his own death. It's a beautiful love story, really. Three, four, thumb war. seconds on the ads oh god I'm just trying to get over here man it has more room this guy brought a shield what a pussy Two of those in a single fight? God, what is this, Christmas? Welcome back, non-subs. Thanks for watching ads. If you got stuck with them, I greatly appreciate it. You know, I, uh, I was watching a video yesterday and I learned that steroids might mess up the, like, uh, the thickness of, like, your hair growing back and whatnot. Basically, it might cause you to lose some hair. And as someone who has never used steroids in his life and started losing his hair, uh, pretty, uh, early in life, clearly, I felt a little cheated. I felt a little cheated. Hey, what up, Denji? You like my hair there, or lack thereof? I pull off the bald look, luckily, Denji, just like you. We pull off the bald look, but... Don't you feel sometimes cheated when you hear something like that? Like, steroids could cause hair loss, and it's like, well, motherfucker. I didn't get no steroids. Maybe steroids... Yeah, maybe steroids have the opposite effect on bald people. They make them, like, weaker. And it grows their hair back. Oh, what a load of horse shit. Oh, God. Oh, dude, I didn't even have time to react. Was my dad bald? No. Hair genetics go on your mother's side. My mom's dad was bald. Hair genetics are more mom-sided. I got an email, which is why I just got hit there.
What was that? Death number 40? My mom's dad is bald. Was bald. Dude ain't alive anymore. But he was bald, yeah. He didn't have hair. Which could explain why my one of my brothers doesn't have any hair. But one of my other brothers has a full head of hair still. Maybe if I get really close to him on that one, I might be able to get a hit on him. This is what peak gaming performance looks like. That, listen, I can't beat Barb in his widow's gun. Listen, I, I, I watch Barb, because everybody on Twitch watches Barb. That dude, peak gaming performance with the widow's peak. Except the peak gaming performance doesn't happen when I lose all my bread. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> the ball card widow gets it out. Chad first time chatter. Bro, what the fuck is going on? Welcome to the stream, Kramer. Kramer Gaming. There ain't no seat in there. still have stuck around from the dangle raid you are mvps i know raids you know kind of dip but it's always nice when some people stick around and hang out i'm always afraid to raid because i don't i like when i raid someone i it's like i always am so happy when i see my viewers stick around in a stream for like a few minutes even if it's like five minutes later it's like oh my god they're still here they're still here chatting with this streamer As the streamer thinks I left to go make, like, dinner or something, but I'm just lurking in the shadows. I know you're about to cut your hand off. Oh, I dove way too early, man. Like Elden Ring, and I got the supply. Elden Ring is just fucking fun to watch. Am I gonna do Five Five's idea for the game swapping? If I'm available, yeah. I thought it was genuinely a very good idea. A lot of people are probably used to watching really good people at Elden Ring in here. I am not very good at Elden Ring. I've played Elden Ring once two years ago and I just beat Dark Souls, but we're here. And sometimes maybe people like watching someone that's not as good even more. Because they can reminisce on the times when they were not good at a certain fight or something. beat Melania. Dude, it took me like a, it took me way too many tries to beat Melania when I didn't beat her. 
I beat her, but it took me a while. This run is already going a million times better than my last run. to me <laughs> glad to be a pro in one person's eyes Godric. I have one flask, so I got six flask. <laughs> The one time he dives and jumps, I fucked it up. I have that dodge every single time. Except that time, man. Yo, get a prediction out here. Will I win right now? Make it like two minutes. Get this thing going. I know I'm going to beat this guy's ass. How many tries for Melania was it for me? In the hundreds, I can tell you that right now. It was in the hundreds before I beat her. It was a solid, like, I think 16 hours. Maybe more. 16 is being generous. She fucking stomped me. Gamble it up. Channel points are useless anyways. But the fight, like, that's the thing. That's how you can tell this game is good. You fight a boss for 16 hours and you're not annoyed at them. You're just like, oh my god, this... Because you know what you do wrong. You know what you do wrong every time you lose. You know exactly what you did. Two rolls? Uh, I'm not getting two. Yeah, you're annoyed at yourself because you didn't execute like you should have. Come on, big boy. I hope that's a lot of points on yes and not no. Hate to steal people's points away. But I guess regardless of the outcome, points are going to be stolen. Alright, let's focus up. The four hit. One, two. Four. The more. Thank <laughs> you. 
bro. Somebody fucking messaged me on Steam right now. Are you kidding me? Get the fuck out of here, Dr. Diddler! I don't think they watch my stream. I think I've been friends with them since like 2011 in Team Fortress 2 days. And they saw me open Elden Ring last night and they were like, Hey, man, like, enjoy Elden Ring. It's gonna be great. So they don't know that I've played it. Big mess up. That was awful. I did so good at that fight, and then I mess up with one thing. Ay, ay, ay. Hopefully, you're getting good pay if you're still at work. A good payday. Nope. That's unfortunate. Ho oh, oh. ho! One toe forward, I would have been dead. Hey, Disco, how many hours into this run are we? Four and a half. And I feel for four and a half hours in, get into Godric ain't too bad. But getting hit by that move is very bad. That's one of those moves that when you get hit by it, you're just like, I can't believe I just fucked that up. Genuinely, it's like, damn, I can't believe I did that. Hey, unexplainably weird. Especially being Nakey. Nah, I already beat this game two years ago. It's coming back to me. And we just beat Dark Souls. The, the Souls-like gaming is with me right now. My two Souls-like experiences. They're powering me through this. Oh, that's not Thumb War. Oh, fuck. I'm not in a good spot. I am not in a good spot. In my first run, I was naked for most of it. I had some pants on. I had no shirt for 90% of the game until I beat Melenia. Then I stole her shirt and wore that to victory with a onion head. Ah, let me respond to this person on Steam. Godric. 
Gaiman. No, not Gasman. Godric Gaiman, I'll say. The Dr. Diddlerino. Yeah, the OG Zoro run. When I was really into One Piece at the time. Oh, wow, that's awkward. We both missed. All right, this is the one. People that say this is the one, it's usually not the one, but don't listen to statistics. chat this time around it's time for the chat to be the wild wild west not by will smith One deaths. Dude, that's the only thing that's hit me twice is that fucking little twister. I didn't want to attack him, I wanted to heal a little bit because I know my flask is fucking booty. Me, I won't read chat. Me, a minute later, reading chat. Bro. Oh my god, what the hell was that, man? Hi, Falcus. Not going hot. This move has hit me goddamn three times. That actually hit me, man.
Okay, we got a good amount of hits. Not a great start. fire move I don't know how to deal with really good job me you missed There's only one flamethrower attack that messes me up. It's this one. Hate that one. second too early a half a second too early probably even less than a half a second i rolled too early on that one like i said you know why you mess up you know why you die 42 yeah he's killed me now i think at least double digits At least double digits. But we know his moveset so well now. I should beat him without even taking any goddamn damage. With how long we've been acquainted. I've been here for 12 deaths. I say I should beat him without taking any damage. And then guess what I do? I take damage like a fool. Like a fool! Uh, 
it ain't a good run until we win. We're at the point we know all of his moves. It's just me not messing up. That's what we gotta do. Are you gonna roll with this one? Are you coming in? Does that attacks? Maybe I don't know all his moves. He does that one so little that I can never remember it. Okay. We're fine. Guaranteed. Here comes the money. He must be pissed that I keep coming back to life. Fuck. You rolling? No. Okay. Who's the nerd with the shield? That's just another guy's playing. Another guy's uh, death that happened. I was in such a bad spot. They have nothing to do with us. Okay. I don't think it's live, but... That'd be weird if it was live. Oh wait, these shadows things are live? So someone else is fighting this guy at the same time as me? Some fucking dweeb. That is so cool. There's probably a lot of shadows when this game dropped. I got cocky, I stayed in too long. That's the story of how I became a father. I got into the fucking second phase last time with like no goddamn flask. I'll do it again. Lock DLC story. Have y'all seen that? The boss that locks the DLC story? They were my like my least one of my least favorite bosses to play against in my first playthrough. They are later in the game. And I hated them.
I don't attack on that one. There's some moves I don't attack on. Fuck me. Oh, no, I'm st <sighs> ay, ay, ay. This butthole of a boss, he's got me a good 13 times, I think. We're up to like 44 deaths. He's got me a good handful of times. I got his move set down, I just do so little damage. Damn right, Dangle, this is the one. I have another game I want to play today, so we're already at five hours of goddamn Elden Ring. Elden Ring is just addicting, man. It's just so addicting to play this game. Even though I've been getting my ass kicked by this boss for 20 minutes. Maybe a little bit more. 40 minutes. Don't talk about it. Fart, how are you doing in uh, Elden Ring? I could have had him in that one. Alright. off the battlefield. Oh, I don't like this. You got a plateau damage-wise, so you need to farm runes and bosses. I feel that right now. I feel that. I say that as I'm doing 70 damage on a hit. I do not like this. I'm way too close. Shit. Got four, got four extra hits on him. Oh, come on, man. Good job going to the gym. I haven't gone in three days.
starving as well, man. I forgot to eat lunch. Goddamn Elden Ring made me forget to eat lunch. Happens to the best of us, I guess. Happens to the best of us. No, Fenner, we don't keep Twinkies in stock. Twinkies are gross. No. Well, actually, Twinkies aren't bad. I haven't had a Twinkie in probably 10 years, though. Three flasks left. A singular strike. Thanks to that Matthew Amat for my sub gift. Her bear hope the DLC is everything you've been waiting for and more. I am pretty excited for it. Thank you for the 48 months, Sam. I hope you're doing good. It is good to see you. We're doing a new playthrough to get ready for it. I'm probably not going to get to the DLC for like a week, but... Uh, the game is as good as I remember it being. Which is very... A phoenix... See you there. It's okay to say you hate bald people, Phoenix. I won't judge you. Just slightly. You'll be bald one day, too. Yo, big hit. Oh, no, 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 no. Give me a move I can hit you with, man. Thank you. Oh, that was a delayed hit. As in, I wasn't reading that well at all. Fuck it, I'll use my last flask. I am glad I came over here, because this move is awful. Despise that move. Despise it, I do. <laughs> well, I like... Oh my god, man. That's so unfortunate that I got basically stuck there. Oh my god, that's so unfortunate. That's so unfortunate. <laughs> no. No 
way. Dude, I just kind of got stuck. I kind of just got stuck there. It happens. I'm lucky that the move I struggle with the most came up like two times in a row, but you know, what can you do? Oh my god, 47 deaths. The red glow and aura gives me, I'm pretty sure, just a slight damage boost. Is that 45? 46? We're somewhere up there, man. What game are we playing after this? I keep forgetting the name of this fucking game that we're playing. What, what, what game are we doing after this? Outer Wilds? Hell no. Good luck, Bullock. Katana Zero? There's literally a dock in I need to get lunch. I'm fucking starving. Mullet Mad Jack. Why do I keep fucking forgetting Mullet Mad Jack's name? Dong and Rampa. We've already done two Dong and Rampas. We don't need to do a third one. Dock me. Flirt. gotta give me a move I can hit you with. One, two, three, four, thumb war. Could probably get a hit on that one if I timed those dodges. his godric <laughs> not gonna lie to you that fucking spirit really messed me up there for a second i thought he was doing the goddamn wind attack this when i saw that spirit pop up left trigger still does the battle cry
Now he's not going to do any moves that I attack on. Saturn's really playing Valorant. Dies so much to this boss. I mean, I've died like 15 times. My dodge game kind of clean. When I've been here for 15 tries, it's gonna get there. But I appreciate it. I feel like if I no life souls like games for let's say two months, I would become very, very good at them. Souls Gamer. Andy, you got hair. I was watching you this morning. You had hair. You have hair, unless you shaved it off in the span of six hours. If so, I respect it. Don't worry. Hair's overrated anyways. Right, fellow bald people? Sorry. Uh. Don't think you want me doing that, Falcus. because that'd be too much souls like. Ugh, the worst move. The only move I don't dodge. God, I hate this fire move. Stop doing it so much. Yeah, do this one. Did it? You quit your job? Good job. Ah! I'm sorry, Dad.
My man. Easy money, man. To our home, oh. Face of gold. <sighs> Godric's Great Rune, Remembrance of the Grafted. 47 deaths or so. Oh, wow! Ads started right then and there. GG. Ads started right then and there. Ad break in progress. Jesus Christ, what timing. Well, YouTube Let's Play, you can like and subscribe, I guess, because everything goes up on YouTube. We'll level up as always. As always, we'll level up. Level up the gamer. We did it. We did it. We did it. We did it.